Hello and uh, welcome back to my videos. In this video, we want to speak about the Python and the Jinja and how you can make the condition like if and else statements. I will uh, show how it's doing. So let's type in the code first, import Jinja2, and then we need the Jinja environment. And then we need a loader. Um, and we place the, the templates inside the template folder. That's fine. So we need what we want here. So let's call it a city. And I want to test with Copenhagen. Now we are ready to, to, to fix our template here. So template here and say ginger2 environment, sorry. And we need to get the template. And it should be layout.html. And then we need to print it out to say template rendering. And then the environment here. Uh, the variables. If I'm going down and say this one, it will make the error because we don't have any kind of uh, template yet. So let's create this template inside the template folder and call it layout.html. We just keep this title as we want and let's say testing. And we need to confirm we have this, um, this template loaded inside. So that's working perfectly. Now we are ready to, to do the if statements. So it's, it's pretty easy. It's like if you have using uh, other language for, for templating. Uh, if you are working with the JavaScript and using the view, it's similar, but not perfect, but it's, it's something like that. So we need uh, this tag and say if city is equal to uh, Copenhagen, we need to uh, tell it down here to say visit Copenhagen. And then we need uh, an ending of it. Let's see what happening now. And visit Copenhagen, that's perfect. So Let's try to do it with uh, Aarhus. It's a, it's a other big city in Denmark. So let's uh, do it the wrong, wrong here. Going up here and say this one. And elif city is equal to Aarhus. And then we're gonna say visit Aarhus. Why try Copenhagen? And then we need an L statement uh, inside here. Don't understand the city you visit. So if we run it again, it's still Copenhagen. If we're going back for the application and say all oh, here and run the application again, you can see visit Aarhus, why try Copenhagen, and we say Rive. Rive is a little town down in Sunderjylland in Denmark. Uh, and it's saying we don't understand the city uh, you visit. And it's a very small city, but it's beautiful if you're coming to Denmark. Uh, you should take a trip to, to Rive. It's, it's very nice. It's having a church and old uh, Vikings and something like that, I will uh, recommend the city. Thank you so much for watching this video. I really hope you enjoy. I hope you want to subscribe to this channel. You can go down in the right corner below and press the ding, and then you subscribe my channel. You can download my code on GitHub. You can follow me on GitHub too, so you can get the new code when I release it. And of course, I hope you want to press a like. If you have a question, make comments below. I'll try to answer them. And then I hope you put it to your playlist and share it with your friends. Thank you so much and hope to see you next time. Bye bye.